Hey guys, it's Matthew and Travis. Today, we're gonna show you guys how to get checked out for Catalina Island. Should be fun. Catalina traffic, Blue and White Sling 135 Whiskey Tango is established right downwind for runway 22 Catalina traffic. Very nice, Matthew. We're gonna walk inside, go get our cookie with our card, and then we're gonna head back to Zorin's. All right, cookies. Five Whiskey Tango is taking runway 22 for right downwind departure, Catalina traffic. Even when it's cloudy, it's nice up here. Yep. Okay, guys, so uh, we're heading over to Catalina. We're gonna get some extra altitude because we wanna be able to glide a little further than usual being over water and being a single engine aircraft. We also have some life jackets in the back that are in case we go down, which we will not. <laughs> Knock on wood, very reliable <laughs> planes, never had a problem, but it's just a thought process that we have. Just, just in case. case. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we will be doing a left 270 out of here. Foreign Tower, Experimental Sling 135, Whiskey Tango, holding short runway 11 left for a left 270 departure. Uh, sling 135, Whiskey Tango, Foreign Tower, left 270 departure is approved, runway 11 left, clear for takeoff. Left 270 approved, 11 left, clear for takeoff, by Whiskey Tango. And if you normally watch us, or you've watched anything from Torrance or flown into Torrance, you'll know that normally that'd be a right 270 departure uh, from 29 or right, but since we're on the winds are opposite and we're on 1 1 left, we're going to make that a left 270 departure. Yep. Here we go. Get out of here, bird. Yeah. And as always, if you're crossing the airfield, you want to make sure you're at least 500 feet above the traffic pattern altitude. And of course, we're going to keep climbing so we get plenty of altitude for going over the water out here. Sling 5 Whiskey Tango, frequency change approved, eh? Frequency change approved, good day, 5 Whiskey Tango. Okay, so we're going to switch over to uh, the PV practice area frequency because that's what we're going to be flying to on the way out here. And speaking of the climb, as we climb, if you zoom out here and look on our map, you see there's a block of five to 10,000 Bravo. So we just wanna make sure that we stay left of that block as we're climbing up to higher than that altitude. TV practice, swing 135 Whiskey Tango is about a mile north of the horseshoe, southbound, uh, 3,800 climbing for 6,500 PV practice. So, uh, as we fly over to Catalina, we want to make sure we're not flying direct to um, Catalina Airport. We want to fly to two harbors. From two harbors over here, we're going to fly over and then enter the traffic pattern from there. Okay, so you guys, we just listened to the ASOS to get weather. And now we're making sure that we're heading in the right direction towards two harbors. And shortly, we will be there. Catalina traffic, experimental sling 135 Whiskey Tango is 10 miles north of the field, and we'll be flying over two harbors and entering the downwind on the 45 to join right traffic for runway 22 Catalina traffic. Catalina traffic, experimental sling 135 Whiskey Tango is five miles north of the field and we'll be entering the right downwind for runway 22, Catalina traffic. So for our viewers out there, you can kind of start to see these two harbors here any other day pretty much. You can see it from really far away. Um, so we know that once we get over these two harbors here, um, we're gonna be turning left. We're going to be going straight at the runway and then we're going to be making another left turn on the 45 to enter into that downwind for runway 22. And as you guys can see, we're starting to make our descent here um, because we don't want to be too high as we get to the airport. Catalina traffic, blue and white sling 135 Whiskey Tango is over two harbors and is making a left turn direct for the runway to enter right traffic for runway 22 Catalina traffic. Matthew's got us descending down to the traffic pattern altitude, which is 2,600 feet. He's got that bugged. Airport elevation is 1,600 feet. So we're doing 1,000 feet above the airport elevation for traffic pattern. So right now, we're entering this downwind on the 45 from two harbors. 
Catalina traffic, blue and white sling 135, Whiskey Tango is established right downwind for runway 22, Catalina traffic. When you're ready, you can make that right base. Yep. Catalina traffic, blue and white sling 135, Whiskey Tango is turning right base for runway 22, Catalina traffic. Downwind right nice little five, correct. Valley through the clouds there for us to get to our airport. Yes, sir. Catalina traffic, blue and white sling 135, Whiskey Tango is making a uh, final turn for runway 22, Catalina traffic. All right, so that upslope of the runway makes it look a little bit shorter, and then as we get down closer, we're not going to be able to see the end of the runway there. Very nice, Matthew. Okay, and beautiful job. As you guys will find out if you come here, it is a bumpy runway. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, this runway was built in a nope. hurry. Okay guys, so just paid up there at the tower and we're gonna walk inside, go get our cookie with our card and then we're gonna head back to Torrance. All right, cookies. All right, back to our plane and ready to go. What's up guys, we just got back into the plane after grabbing some food and a cookie. We're holding short of the runway. We're gonna do a right downwind departure, which will take us out back over the coast in a northbound direction, headed back towards Torrance. Catalina traffic, blue and white sling, 135 Whiskey Tango is taking runway 22 for right downwind departure, Catalina traffic. Okay, line ourselves up, head bug, and here we go. Catalina traffic, blue and white sling 135, Whiskey Tango turning right crosswind for right downwind departure, Catalina traffic. Catalina traffic, blue and white sling 135, Whiskey Tango is turning downwind for right downwind departure, Catalina traffic. All right, and so like headed uh, over in this direction, we're going to climb up to a decently high altitude. We're going to climb to 5,500, just give ourselves extra glide range. We've got those life jackets in the back, not that we plan to need them. Even when it's cloudy, it's nice up here. Yep. Catalina traffic, blue and white sling, 135 Whiskey Tango is 2.4 miles to the uh, north. We'll be leaving the area, last call, Catalina traffic. November. Short term rotation, November time, 1847, Zulu wind, 110 at 7, Zulu wind. Okay guys, so one more thing to look out for here on the way back to Torrance. Obviously you're going to be at least 5,500 if not more. And again, that Bravo block to our left is 5,000 to 10,000. So you will go into that Bravo if you're at a high enough altitude. So what you want to do is just make sure that your route to Torrance does not go through that Bravo shelf. All right, so for landing at Torrance on a 1-1, we could do one of two things. We could cross over midfield or we could circle around the point over that direction and come in for right traffic. Uh, Torrance Tower, Sling 135, Whiskey Tango. We're about eight miles uh, south of the field. Uh, coming in for 1-1 one, one left. How would you like us to enter? Number 135, Whiskey Tango, Torrance Tower. Uh, Ident, verify information November. Enter a right base for runway 1-1 one, one right. All right, Ident, uh, right base for 1-1 one, one right. Five, Whiskey Tango, we have November. So guys, as we're getting closer here, we're obviously going to want to lose some of this altitude. And as you can see, we've waited until we're easily close enough that if something happened, we could glide to land. And uh, because of that, we're going to now have to descend for the airport altitude. PVE practice, sling 135 Whiskey Tango's a uh, mile south of the horseshoe, descending 5,500 uh, down to, the, to uh, Torrance. 135 Whiskey Tango. Okay, so guys, the other thing to remember also is that on a normal wind day, normal, uh, we will be landing on 29 or right. So in that case, the best course of action would be to descend over Vincent Thomas Bridge, call for Vincent Thomas Bridge to the tower, and they'll usually clear you direct into 29 or left or 29 or right that way. Yep. 
135, which thing is going to You're number one for runway 11 right, clear to land. Number one, one one right, clear to land, five whiskey tango. Sling five whiskey tango, traffic is off your left, one mile, 1,600 indicated sling on final for the north runway. Looking for traffic, five whiskey tango. Oh, the no factor with your turn now, so thank you. Beautiful. Okay, guys, so here we are on short final, one one right, back at Torrance.